I think that's an accurate choice. I mean, I think any combination would be accurate. We're almost there. We're almost done. Oh my god, almost proms. How are we gonna have this orgy? And the proms tomorrow. The proms. Send me to the tree. I'm just gonna like. Why are you going to the tree? Because I want to round out my stats. Okay. Because I never know what I need to use here. The day during recess, you start a half hour rave that goes full crazy. Everything is fine until one small magical Latino cat asks you what you think you're doing. Damn, you didn't remember you suck at dancing. No, no. But you decide to go all in and pretend it's a new dance move, apparently called the Groovy Mus Musaka. One looks at you and he asks you to teach him the Groovy Musaka. Ooh, redeemed. In no time, half the party is following your steps and enjoying the Groovy Musaka all together. It's musaka a party now. to remember. <laughs> you gain plus two fun and a cool story to tell your grandkids someday. Yeah, I don't know if people know this, but Monster Prom is funded by Big Musaka. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I had to say it like three times. Around the corner, you hear the sound of princessly singing in eelish maracas. That can only mean one thing. <laughs> oh, Mr. Feel the Eel, I'm just so excited for the winter surf party. I could Under the ocean. sing. Oh boy, I can't wait. Oh, I guess. I was going to say that I'm so excited I could burn down a medium-sized village. But singing is a great idea, too. Let's na, do it. Na, 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 oh, the surf. surf! The Little Monarch's Book of Etiquette clearly states murder is one of the... One oh, of the... Yeah. Please, no, please no Sue. Please no Sue Disney. Please no Sue. <laughs> please no Sue. <laughs> yeah. You give Miranda and her murderous eel a standing ovation. Yeah, thank you. You were already standing, so technically you could just started clapping, but it still counts. Hello. I didn't even see you there, fellow surf. You're definitely not a surf, but you're not about to correct an eel with a hidden switchblade. Uh, beautiful singing princess. Such an honor to join you in the magical wonder of song. <laughs> You know, it's times like these that I'm so happy that I have surfs. I mean, if you weren't here, who would listen to my lovely singing voice? Me? Listen to my own voice? I don't think so. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is the thought of the Princess Miranda songs going to wait. <laughs> oh, don't cry, Mr. Feel the Eel. I know it will make you feel better. Extensive and laborious party planning. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're right, princess. That would cheer me up right away. <laughs> I knew it. In that case, we're missing one critical thing for the winter surf party. Activities! This will likely be the only party my surfs will ever have the chance to attend, so we should make it as fun and memorable as possible. <laughs> oh, wee! I'm bursting with ideas. P -p princess, we could play Shave the Princess's Neck! And each surf could shave your neck with their sharpest sword. Doesn't that sound adorable? <laughs> OMG, I love it. Everyone will admire how hairless my neck is. I mean, my neck is already hairless, but I guess if everyone used their swords on my neck, it will be even more hairless. Kawaii Disney. Or we could dig a special princess pit and fill it with the cutest animals. Feral panthers. He's making the XD face. And Princess Miranda, you could pet fluffy panthers all night in your special inescapable pit. Yes, yes, yes. Mr. Feel the Eel, you are a genius. Down with the or we could simply sit you down on your gluttonous throne and read aloud one by one a list of the atrocities and injustices you have committed until Poseidon himself smites you down. <laughs> down with the Mer Kingdom! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I love you, princess. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, Mr. Feel the Eel, you're so precious. I didn't even know peasants could be this cute. Ooh. Anyway, as I was saying, oh, wow, a butterfly. The regal monarch yeah, butterfly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. butterfly. <laughs> yeah. Miranda abruptly leaves to chase the butterfly, but wait, that means you're alone with... Salutations. Salutations. You have done well to weather the tyranny of the Vanderbilt so far, but fear not, the day of their demise fast approaches. The evil princess is falling into our trap just as we intended. She thinks she's choosing a party activity, but she will actually choose the method of her own death. <laughs> the irony is as delicious as the sweat of the proletariat. Bye, comrade. Ah, she returns. So long, comrade. May the blood of the monarch salt the earth. I mean, uh, there we are. <laughs> Oh, party planning can be so stressful, but I feel so much better after 
vivisecting that butterfly. <laughs> Fun fact, the most beautiful part of a butterfly is its gorgeous glistening stomach innards. I'm sorry, Jesse. <laughs> Murdered oh, no, your butterfly. the regal monarch butterfly. <laughs> oh, no. Well, she had I to kill the other monarch. I guess that should have been last place because yeah. that butterfly did. Oh, did Mr. Field run off again? Well, whatever. His party activity suggestions were just so perf. Why can't we just use... We can just use one of them, unless you have anything better in mind. Oh, boy. Impress Miranda with a killer party activity. Well, not literally killer. Ideally, you're hoping for something fun, family-friendly, and assassination-proof. Okay, security game. If you murder someone, you lose. You're looking for a game that serves the opium of the people, but there is no better opium of the people than actual opium. That's definitely fun, right? That's fun. <laughs> um... Uh... I have no idea what the stat for the security game would be. Let's try the first one. Okay. Oh, boy. Yeah, security game. <laughs> So creative. Oh, that sounds fun. What are the exact rules? No murder at all? So thrilling. <laughs> oh, and what about just mild homicide? Does that count as an infraction? And how many servers should be killed for it to count as a full real murder? Mm. Oh, and are torturing in other ways of paid infliction valid, or does it count as cheating? Actually, if you lose by murder, then how would you win? By inflicting as much pain as possible without actually killing? <laughs> Intriguing. So many questions. This activity seems so weird and silly. Not murdering. Who would have thought? Not... No one being murdered around here for more than 24 hours. Unheard of. You gain plus two creativity and plus one spot wow, for your all those nines. Send me back to the bathroom. Send me back <laughs> to the bathroom. <laughs> That day you skip class just to hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. It's true. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But you don't stop there. You want the world to know how reckless you are and, for, and are for the rest of eternity. So you do some graffiti on the wall. No way! That's, yes way. The, the graffiti I hope it's says, I'm bold as fuck. And you know what? It turns out the wall is a magical wall that grants wishes. <gasps> what a wall! Uh -oh. A deep voice resounds from it within the walls and says, Well, not as bold, but maybe a bit bold. And then you gain plus two bold. Whoa, yeah. sick. Oh boy, that's an opinionated wall. Anyway, lucky you. <laughs> You're casually practicing some magic spells when Damien and Scott come <laughs> running up to you. Here we go. Dude! Bro! <laughs> we just had a fucking sick idea! But we need your help to make it work! Shh, Scott, be cool. Oh yeah, I'm being cool. I can be cool. Okay, picture this. A family-style pasta restaurant in the fifth circle of hell! We'll call it Pasta Paradise! Scott and Damien's Pasta Paradise. Scott's got the blueprints all drawn up. I've got the real estate rights. All we need is someone who can turn griffins into pasta. Uh, I didn't know this was a plot thread. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, Damien. Yeah? Why are we getting get enough griffins to stock a whole restaurant with pasta? Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, listen. I'm willing to cut you in on this business venture. But only if you can help us find enough griffins to stock our kitchen. Nice move, Damien. That's why you're the brains. Damn right. So how about it? Jesus Christ. Can I also oh, just real quick explain that when <laughs> Jesse does Damien, he lowers his like full body. And then when he does Scott, he like sits up. It's he really like cute. perks up yeah. when he does yeah. Scott. Gotta be there when all the it's boys like, were in Jesus. It's just like all the, the physical representation. <laughs> You gotta be the character. It's, it's, really it's, it's really good. It's, we're complimenting. You like fully throw yourself into these roles. Oh my God. <laughs> Obviously, you start another business next door. Scott and Damien's Griffin grooming. Believe it or not, you can actually make pasta without turning Griffins into it. That's a smarty boy answer. <laughs> that seems smart. Let's go for that. You gotta play to your strengths. All right, here we go. You're doing it. I know. There you go. What? What? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Are you telling jokes right now? Are you serious? Be cool, Scott. Be cool. I can't be cool. This news is too exciting. Scott, play dead. Scott <laughs> drops to the floor and stops talking. <laughs> okay. Whew. All right. So you're telling me there are ways to make pasta without using Griffins? This is a real game changer. This will put us way ahead of the competition. I got to get started on our business plan. I won't forget this. Damien runs off, leaving Scott lying on the floor. Is he... is he still breathing? You should probably check. In any case, you gain plus two creativity and plus one smart. Great. Scott died. Oh, I can't. Well, Scott shit. died on the way to his home. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go now. My oh, planet boy. needs me. Uh, Where are we going? Uh, you could... 
man, you, you're pretty good going pretty much anywhere. Yeah, I can't, I don't think I want to go to the library. I already went to the auditorium. I don't want to do that. I guess the gym? Yeah, go to the guy. What's the guy? <laughs> that day an epic dodgeball match takes place. At one point, you're about to be eliminated by a player from the other team. But suddenly you convince him not to throw the ball at you with a heartfelt speech about the importance of everyone's lives. The player bursts into tears and you take advantage of the moment of weakness throwing a ball at him. Ruthless. <laughs> you lose minus five mercy. Instead, that might be useful in Monster Prom's sequel, but it isn't now. And you gain plus two charm. Hell yeah. Narrator waves his hand at you. Hey! Uh, <laughs> yeah! Great, great. Whatever, you're in the place wait. at the I'm school so anyway, spoiled. I need to talk to you. Look, I know what you're up to. I've seen you do this dozens of times with pretty much everyone here. No! I've seen it all. The careful choices between two wacky options, the fiendish the fiendish stat optimization, your tendency to mostly remain silent for some <laughs> reason. And, I mean, I think you're cute, and I really appreciate you finally figuring out a way for me to get out Am of I narrating getting rejected? Dramatic pause to allow someone to show up and cause narration-related problems again. No? Oh, okay. Don't you dare, narrator. As I was saying, I really <gasps> like you, but what I don't experience stats? spooky high like the rest of your classmates. I'm acutely aware of the fact that I have lived the same three-week period leading up to prom <laughs> hundreds of thou- No, thousands of times. <laughs> it's always the same. I talk you through the lead-up to prom. You ask someone out, and they usually laugh in your face, and then... It's three weeks before prom again, and everyone seems to have forgotten all about what happened. I'm the only one who remembers. Oh, God. Meta. This poor narrator. I don't know what I've done to deserve this He's torment. He's just Groundhog Daying forever. Oh my god, is, does he want you to kill him? Oh, <laughs> <no>! <laughs> he gives you a gun. He's like, please. <laughs> is this a private hell constructed to punish an unvirtuous life? Am I the mere plaything of some sadistic deity? Am I in a coma, spinning this elaborate yarn to provide some stimulation to my slowly deteriorating brain? I'll never know for mm. sure. All I know is that every time you decide you want to try boinking one of your classmates again, I'm forced to repeat the same zany three weeks one more time. So, I get that you're trying to ask me to prom, and I'm flattered. Don't you know. But it's this... It's just hard to get in the mood when I'm acutely aware of the private hell I perpetually inhabit, you know? Oh. How do I get you to ah. love me? But what about... Sex. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Kristen. one of these answers is more on brand than the other. I yeah. the second one is pretty <laughs> bold. <I> yeah. <laughs> but you, but you oh, but it's also surprise. charming. True. Yeah, it'd yeah. be charming. How do you know that going won't break the curse? Huh? Yeah. Mm. yeah. Yeah. That's definitely not a bold answer, but it's yeah. better up for your stats. Mm. So, what do you want to do? Let me think. Like, I want to say the second one, but I don't know. Would the first one convince him? This is big. This is big. This, this is the day before prom. Yeah. Oh. What happens? I don't know. I just want him to love me, and I don't know how to make that happen. <laughs> I think. I think the first one's. Gonna the first play one's going to gonna be better more. for what you have available to you. Wait, what'd you say? Say again. The first. The first one's going to be available for the stats you have available to you. Right. 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 <laughs> You just want to bang this guy. I get I it. Do. You can still do that without having to say it you're to right. him. You know you're that, right? right? You're right. I, you're right. You can I be mean, subtle. The long, yeah. the game. You can still have sex with a man without being like, I want to. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, let's you're do right, it. Right. Let's do I this. Can Ooh, make him yeah. his idea. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. so nice of you. I know. Okay. Oh, the first one. Then. Okay. I got this. There you go. Okay. Oh, so okay. smart. You All right. Know. All right. That Cheers. might be crazy enough to work. For the first thousand years of my imprisonment, I tried asking people to prom. But that's before I got super buff out of boredom, so no one wanted to smooch me. I want to smooch! I want to see, like, I want to see, like, bigger the narrator. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Every time you play again, it's just yeah, yeah, yeah. bigger. Yeah, yeah, After that, it's just never occurred to me. I suppose I was driven so mad by solitude and repetition that I felt like it, it made more sense to desire sexual satisfaction from narrating other people's lives. <laughs> But going to prom with you, do you think it could really work? Yes, 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 oh, yes. Oh, at this time, I thought I was trapped in here because of all those kids I murdered, but maybe I'm really <laughs> here to learn the meaning of true love. Yikes! Jesus! <laughs> what? All right, I'm in. And if it doesn't work, at least we can beat the shit out of everyone on the dance floor and they won't remember. Mm, sure. Here, take plus two oh, trauma oh, and plus one yeah. gold. You're going to need it if you want to keep up with me. Damn! Oh. <laughs> All okay. Right. If he right. says no to me when I ask him to prom, I swear to G. Well, I can't do boldness. I'm going to have to do creativity. My boldness sucks. That day, while rehearsing for the class play, you aren't especially good nor inspired. That's because I'm not bold. Yeah, but <laughs> for once, it seems you aren't getting the classic creativity boost from, uh, from the auditorium. 
But afterwards, what, while talking to your classmates, you're having trouble conveying your point in a discussion. So you decide to convey it through music! Oh. You start singing, and suddenly everyone else joins in in a kick-ass musical number. It's so amazing the people with whom you were arguing totally get your point and change their minds once the song is over. You gain plus two creativity. Nice. nice. Very nice. When you started this whole orgy thing, yeah. you always knew this day would come. <laughs> oh boy. Here we go. The day you had to talk Vera into the orgy. Oh boy. Even Miranda turned out to be quite into orgies. Who'd have thought? But Vera, you're still not sure on how she'll take the invitation. Oh, I'm her, aren't I? <laughs> yeah. All right. that boy I don't think I've it. ever seen you're her right. theater outfit. She looks great. Yeah, it's really good. She looks like she should be in WoW or something. Yeah, yeah 100%. Sure. Uh, no. <laughs> but... It's always the same with you, Polly. Don't get me wrong, I appreciate some good sex. Uh, if, good, if good enough. Sorry, lost it. Lost I, the couldn't, character already. I couldn't stay away from that. Uh, but with you, it's always sex, girl. I don't want to encourage this behavior of yours. You should challenge yourself to be more than this happy-go-lucky sex and drugs caricature. Uh, I am. You know, I am also fucking good at literature and chess, thanks to my family. Wink at camera. <laughs> yeah, I know, but how often does that come up when facing wacky misadventures? I just want to keep some backstory details to myself so that, like, they're more surprising when discovered. It's 101 and good character building. I thought building. that was lol. <laughs> me too. It's Over his LOL and good character building. <laughs> sure, then ping me when you want to plan a chess tournament or a literary picnic. <laughs> you are such a party pooper. I am out. She phases out. You're left alone with Vera. You understand her take on this, but the thing is, she never said she dislikes the idea of an orgies in itself. She just dislikes Polly's fixation with sex. So you think you can actually solve that, while also focusing on Vera's interests. We can do this. <laughs> Vera, a blowjob <laughs> is about sex, a threesome is about sex, but an orgy? An orgy <laughs> is about networking. <laughs> look at all the people who are coming. Yeah, look, look at all the people <laughs> who are coming. <laughs> <laughs> Holly might be about sex. She's pouring her soul into this because she wants to wants to, to go beyond just sex. This notebook shows our super weird out of the box ideas for orgy. That's creativity. Mm. I both of these. The first one might be, be smart. smart. Yeah. Is it? Uh, I mean, I'm it terrified. It's bold. Mm, uh, I don't know if that would be bold if it, it's about networking. That's a very Vera answer at the top. Yeah. Line. So. Mm. I think you would nail the first one. All right, I'm trusting all of you so I can get this orgy. <laughs> I've never trusted oh, no. more people to have an orgy happen <laughs> in my life. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh, oh, it works. Tell me more. You show her the que the guest list for the orgy, the quest list for the orgy. <laughs> yes. Wow, I'm in the wow mode. Um, somehow you and Polly have been so focused on this that the guest list is kind of crazy. Scott, Miranda, what? Your four fortune. 500 CEOs? What's this? You got an Arab sheik? I've been trying to negotiate with him to get a better price for my oil imports for some of my ventures. Oh, and the Silicon Valley tech mogul. I've wanted to license some of her tech to a guy I know in the freight I can't read sector for a very long time. This is pure gold, LimeWire. I think I can even ignore the creepy fact that these people are attending an orgy planned by high school. <laughs> <laughs> I might even use that as leverage to blackmail. I mean, to negotiate with them. Okay, Polly, you can come out of the ghost zone. I'm in. I'm going yes! ghost! I knew you were spying on us, you creepy voyeuristic cute little idiot. You know me, Winku. <laughs> so it seems it's a wrap. The yes! orgy is bound to be epic. Oh my God. You gain plus two fun and plus one charm. Oh, it's Did happening! Did you fucking pull this the off? The orgy is happening! Did you pull this off? I don't know oh how to Oh my God. The oh my do God. Do I choose Polly? I don't know what to do. I don't know what I'm doing. But Miranda, right. I guess. So you're Miranda? I guess. I All have right. to. All right. I'm so worried. Miranda's the, the storyline you're going with, right? Yeah, I guess I, I that we did the we did the thing. Sure, yeah. yeah. Sure. Yeah, we did the the Mr. Field the, the surf thing. Party? Yeah. yeah, the surf party. <laughs> Alright, Napster. Give me that demon boy, although I think, I think he's going you to be orgy. This. I I don't th uh, I don't think any of us are gonna have a up? date because I think they're all going to be orgy. Ask Damien into prom. <laughs> yeah, yep. Can I I think you go with yourself? And then the narrator will have to show up? Yeah, I mean, that would be my guess. Maybe. Is that 
Maybe. I guess that's how we, what I we have to do. I think none of them is okay. yeah, going it's for a special them. character. Okay, yeah. yeah, yeah, let's try that. Unless we keep going to the side. Is, is he, yeah, is he off is screen? He no, so he's not off screen. That would be sure? really funny. <laughs> press up, press down, no, press everything. Jesse. Can't. I'm pressing everything. Okay, 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 let's just do this. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope. Yes. How do I get the orgy? Do I go with Polly? I guess you have you to go have with to, Polly. I, think, right? I guess so. She's yeah. the one organizing it. I guess. All right. God bless, Polly. Or I'm nervous for all of us. In for a penny. In for a pound. In for a pound. <laughs> in for a Polly. In for a pound. In for Polly. In for a pound. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm so scared. Oh my God, guys. Please. You ask none of them to prom because you really wanted to ask <laughs> me. Me. Yay. And the narrator said yes. <laughs> no. Wink. <laughs> But no, really, I'd love to. Oh my God, I'm so happy. I've seen this so many times. This is some kind of ancient curse. Every event, every outcome, most of you being rejected, if I had to be honest, repeating unto exhaustion. I've seen you having delightful prom nights many times with all kinds of different people, yet never with me. Aww. But that's about to change, right? You and the narrator have the time of your life. Oh, he's got a little tuxedo. Speedo. He's wearing exactly what I a, a tux speedo. You dance and kiss oh, and you uh, laugh. Oh, we you kiss, you we kiss you. You tell oh the narrator God. you've always thought he is the smartest, coolest, handsomest person at Spooky High. He Actually, is. in the whole world. <laughs> so he does the best narrating and he rocks his narrator hats and he's the humblest person ever. Uh -huh. And so the narrator smiled at you and told you, we will have tons of wild sex tonight. And you do. Yay! Kristen. I have the best He's so ending. happy. I hit Jesse. I got <laughs> Because of this oh. is bound to repeat forever and at least you can break the cycle for just one night, you know? Oh my god. Who knows? Maybe next time you relive those dreadful three weeks, even if everything will look the same, something will have slightly changed. Uh oh! oh. Because you will know that the narrator is there, narrating especially for you. Oh my god, oh. I love this girl. What could What could that mean? Ah. Oh. oh. <laughs> this is you. I forgot. Yeah. I was really excited about my new boyfriend, the narrator. <laughs> the, the narrator. <laughs> the narrator. Oof. Oof. <laughs> Get out of here, Jesse. <laughs> Greetings, Kazar. Oh, how gentle of you asking me. Gentle? gentle of me asking me to prom. Unfortunately, I have an event to attend that evening, so it won't be possible. I'm telling you. Uh oh. Orgy We're time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. If I you think that might be what happened. I didn't even think that. Really screw up. <laughs> <laughs> did you yes. did you screw yes. all of us except oh, for yes. Kristen? Yes. Wow. I don't even need an orgy. I yeah. didn't even think of that. You have been. Prom night oh, arrives and you oh failed at getting a date because half the class is attending an orgy. You're totally missing. No! Oh, Blobber's no, there. Blobber. This is amazing. Oh no. Does that mean? Oh no. You can't help but think about your friends having probably a better time at the orgy. <laughs> it seems you've been seriously outplayed. Oh my god. Um, oh sure. no, oh, does that mean oh, TV? No. No. What? No, I promise we're losers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to an orgy because orgies are for winners. Can we, can there be a monster pump shirt that says orgies are for winners? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to the orgy not to prom. What about you? I, I According to Damien's simplistic criteria, it seems you're a loser. <laughs> at least this time. Prom night arrives and you failed at getting a date because after class is dead in the orgy, you're totally. Blobber, blobber. Wow, look at him. Look at, I like Liam's look at, at Blobber. That's, even, even blobber That's his Blobber's it, like <laughs> feeling everybody yeah, right he's, now. Yeah, he's got it all going on down yeah. there. People are actually having a good time at prom and you can't help but think about your friends actually probably having a better time at the orgy. It seems you've been seriously outplayed. No. By who? Who by me? Oh, it's oh, Jesse. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, boo. Sure, we have a plan for prom night, Winky. And by plan, I mean a fucking awesome orgy. <laughs> yeah. You know, sex isn't everything for sure, but oh boy, is it nice. Bless it's you. It's orgy time. Oh, <laughs> orgy manager. Get prom out night comes and all of you miss prom because get it's clearly stated that an orgy is a way better plan. Now that is prom. an achievement I'm going to highlight <laughs> on my Steam account it forever. Put, put a big old thing. Orgy Make it your manager. Twitter banner, yeah. etc. Yeah. And what a night. Lots of people attend. There are lots of activities, a puppet show, an Indonesian cuisine class, a complete live mm. orchestra. And yeah, lots of kinky sex. And lots of it! Yay! Yay! Hooray! It's a magical night. You never expected an orgy to be such a bonding experience. Yeah, we all learned about each other. Yeah, yeah it's networking. This right? will definitely be an orgy <laughs> to remember. Hooray! Yay! Wow! Yay! That's crazy. How fun! Damn! All right. All right. One yeah. last piece of unfinished, unfinished business. business. Two secret endings. Two secret yeah, endings. Yeah, because that's so fun. Yeah. 
I was gonna say porn ending. Yeah. It counts. Yeah. The porn ending. The dirtiest ending. ending. Yeah. The narrator. Oh the narrator. Oh my gosh, we did it! Wow, that's impressive. Uh, and all of those students boned each other. Yeah. There are so many people we didn't see. Look at yeah. the little Pika boy. Those two love. weeks were maybe the most epic and absurd weeks of our lives. After the monster prom, we kept on living our lives, falling in love, battling for friendship, and learning about who we were and who we could be. And you know what? Like it always does, life happened, and it was wonderful. Damien lo loved fire to the very end. Unfortunately, that wasn't a super legal affair, and he ended up in prison for arson. Fortunately, Did he go to prison? prison was flammable. <laughs> yeah, uh, binding prison. Hmm. Uh, Polly's drug cooking skills proved useful, and she became a chemist for the pharmaceutical industry. But in her free time, she still cooks the real shit. Oh, yeah. Okay, hand sign. Her <laughs> greatest inventions so far are watermelon flavored ecstasy and a thing called Ellis Dope. Mm. Miranda used her vast knowledge of serves to get a job handpicking the best serves for other people. Unsurprisingly, she ended up leaving her serves to do the work. For those two weeks, the monster prom seemed larger than life, and then it was gone. Yeah, just there's like so many that. characters we didn't see. Yeah. That's true. Oh, we never found out if Miranda just didn't get assassinated. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, she's alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah so she's, she's there. Fine. She went to the orgy, so she missed yeah. her own party. Once again, we were young. <laughs> I saved her life. <laughs> and <laughs> unafraid, and we were ready to start. Hooray. Yeah. Dum, 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 we dum. did it. Yay. There's, even, job, a new, there's even a new ending song. Yay. That's true. Oh, that's a cute Aww. outfit. Oh, the shopkeeper's there. Hooray! Aww, so much fun! There's art. Art is a sweetie pie. Art is I so sweet. Hello, yeah. yeah. Maggie, too. Corey's wonderful as well. Oh, my God. Everybody on, everybody on the Who's side. that? Who's it's that weird. guy? Adam, Who's he's, that a, he's a great, great director. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. That's so great. Just oh like God. a hipster I, gremlin. I freaking love the, the Polaroids in here. They're, They're so, really cute. so cute. You can buy them right now on the Yeti. Can you really? Yeah. They're, most of them are sold out, though. Oh, really? Aww, yeah. That's so cute. Yeah. Art, I actually commissioned Art to draw a new Twitch icon for me. Did a good job. Aww. Yeah. I can't wait to see all the characters. We might see some things in Aww. here that you've never seen before because we unlocked some things. Crazy. Oh, that's true. <laughs> Monster Fest. Yeah, all right. Oh, oh she's got Frank a thick Masters. mustache. Frank Master. That is so good. a great that's secret ending, by the way. All, I think all the secret endings in this game are just phenomenal. Look at all these cute yeah, people. Who are all these people? Who are all these people? Who are those people? Who's, the, who's the Slayer? Oh. Who's the Slayer? Oh. Who's oh. that? Oh my god, there's so yeah. many people. Uh, Ross is in here. Yeah. So many Chris is in this. Oh. I haven't found, I haven't seen Susie's character yet. Yeah, or oh, there were so many characters. <laughs> there was somebody missing in that list. Yeah, yeah weird. weird. That's so strange. Yeah, huh. It feels like there's, there's, one person is not there yet. Yeah, a secret yeah. character. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Also, not, the, the Yogg is very good if you're- I'm not saying there's literally a future update that's coming out right after this Let's Play goes up mm -hmm. that will add a certain person uh -huh. to the list Man. of the cast. Yeah, no, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's probably but not this is, this is 100% probably the first time anyone will have ever seen that, that a certain character is David. Mm -hmm. oh yeah. God. Wow, crazy. Yeah, that's it's, nuts. Though. It's wild that you're here for this Octo. Yeah. That's so <laughs> hey, thanks for having me. Yeah, I'm thanks. sure. I'm sure that whoever uh, voiced that character is very thankful. Yeah, probably yeah. very, very thankful. Yeah. Whoever that is. Yeah, wh whomever it may or may not be. Six Woo! new gallery. Oh, oh my god. Hold on. What it. is one of them? The orgy? Probably. It probably <laughs> is. If there is. If there is a god, orgy. Oh, oh, oh my boyfriend friend, though. Very hey. nice. Aww. There he is. Hey, there he is. Oh my gosh. Right. Uh, oh god, hey. I fucking. I fucking love the the dragon ending. I think I got that one time. In our that's like the very oh, yeah. first thing we ever did. Yeah, that's true. Oh, oh my god, wait, there he is. Oh, oh I, saw, I saw his ass. Hold on. I want, I want to see if there's like <laughs> concept art or something. I, Dolly oh, is great go. too. Oh, yeah. I would love we, to do a Dolly at Dolly. Oh, oh my god. I saw uh, when they first posted her on Twitter oh. and I was like, ah, oh, my aesthetic. Yeah. <laughs> Big ogre waifu. Oh, ogre more? waifu. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there is. Yeah, this sweet, this sweet boy up here. Where'd he go? There he is! Oh, yeah, he's look at ripped! Him. He's oh, ripped. Variations. Uh -huh. Oh, oh. <laughs> so, oh. Kiss you, kiss you. Oh. Ooh, there it is. Yeah. You know, I'm sure whoever received the uh, the lines for that character when they saw the cat face uh -huh. had like 50 different takes of that. Oh. Yeah. I got my you, last You're probably one. right. Oh, Aw, that's cute. I, I love the, the fan, fan art. I love the fan art. Mm -hmm. It's so great. I'm so proud of us. Hey, okay. This game's, this game's still real fun. Yes. Thank for you. Sure. Thanks for having the, us. Man, Thank you guys for being added here. Added so much us. stuff to it. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, the DLC has a ton. A lot. 
<laughs> you notice there's like all these different monsters that we didn't even see. Yeah. There's brand new ones. I, I want to know about that Spirit Knight boy. Ah, the Spirit Knight? Yeah. All I'll tell you is... Hello there, fellow teams. That's the, that's, I'm not gonna spoil them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no spoils. Great, okay. yeah. That's really good. All right, well, that's it for us. Thank you so much for watching and more Monster Prom soon, I'm sure. Yeah. Yes. Find Blobbert, date Blobbert. He yeah. needs dates. He's that's great. Of Poor little boy. Uh, find Slayer. Yeah. <laughs> Just to say hi. We did. <laughs> She's so lovely. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. You know, where's the payoff? Bring the strippers and boots. We do occasionally talk about video games. Bring the strippers and boots! Out of that town of vintage games. Bring the strippers and boots! Oh, thank God, I don't need pants now. Hey, JC! What are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a Kalashima broadcast. Yeah, now sing the music. It's a Kalashima broadcast. Bring the strippers and boots! It's a Kalashima broadcast. Now I'm here to ask and answer one simple question. It's a Kalashima broadcast. <laughs> you